Filipino hiya. Um, if you see it written, it's like, well, it's hiya, but it's actually pronounced hiya, as if H double E Y A hiya. Um, it's a. It's described as a shame in UK text a lot, but it's to do with. Um, it's more proprietary. It's. I would say it's more an etiquette thing that the shames cause from not following it. Uh, for example, the debt of gratitude for those that um, helped you through education or taking care of your parents when they get old uh, financially, etc. All these things are tied with um, higa, uh, whether um, you're actually doing it right because people will actually sort of shun you in some ways with it because it also has an effect outside of yourself if you do something bad it can not only affect you but your extended family another thing with he yeah it could be something of not only a debt of gratitude such as education but it could be somebody's actually done something for you and you need to return that debt um, but a debt in the Philippines doesn't mean it's like for like, it can be ongoing. Um, this is why you'll see a lot of things like in elections where they're giving parties and stuff. It's not only just buying votes, it's actually creating a debt. It's a cultural debt that you they have to repay. It, you know, culturally, this is all tied with here. Um, so be aware it's a it's it's very common in Asia anyway but what you do has an impact on others for example this is where some expats go very very wrong so they have a falling out with their wife or whatever have an affair or something and the, the neighborhood is aware of it so he's like well th that's her fault blah 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 no because you've missed one of the basic fundamentals in Filipino society. You have embarrassed and shamed her, which means you've embarrassed and shamed her entire family. Um, because culturally, the burden is the family, not just the one individual, but also, I don't agree with that anyway, you know, doing that sort of stuff anyway. But the, the, the whole idea of this being that you should be aware that this exists and it's a very important one because it can get you in a lot of trouble if you don't uh, at least acknowledge it um, because people don't like to lose face they don't like to um, be publicly humiliated it's all tied with here um, and I advise reading up on it a bit more because you'll find it can make your life a bit easier but also people find you a bit more respectful if you actually respect it but it can also be prone for a little bit of abuse but at the same time you'll find a lot of stuff rotates around it within the culture